Good Friday morning. Well, got my scrap yard run done. Picked up a few things at the yard while I was there. Uh, about 1,800 pounds. 146 dollars. Still eight cents a pound, so is what it is. So this pile got a lot bigger. That pile got a whole lot bigger. Computer guy stuff. Computer guy stuff. Computer guy stuff. Computer guy stuff. Uh, and then I picked up a bunch of uh, laptops, computers, and some other crap. So that'll be more computer guy stuff. You better bring an empty car this time. And yeah, a couple little pieces of crap there for him. So when you watch this, clean out your damn car. So went to my buddy's office, picked up a, a furnace. And this stuff here, that piece of golden goodness there. Uh, a bunch of stuff from the scrapyard. This was a big. Um, I don't remember what it said. So I was trying to make it lighter because the thing's heavy as hell. So four power supplies, three blades inside of it, each one, two, four, seven uh, sticks of a uh, RAM. Some boards over here that were in it. Some boards in here that I got to pull out. Bunch of laptops. Um, a lot of I series stuff in here. Uh, I've seen a lot of some I5. Whoa! I5s and stuff. And, <laughs> because I'm an idiot, cut off ends. Three tubs. Totes. Whatever. So, yeah. But I got somebody that's going to sort this out for me. So, like all these here. Ow. Oh, I fell. Almost. Oh, no, I fell. All of these here, I sell the board sort. Um, 25 cents a pound, I think. And then there is a ton of uh, a lot of this stuff, too. So, yeah. But there's a ton of uh, gold connector ends and all this stuff, too. And since I'm going Monday, and I already have a couple buckets of connector ends, we will just uh, add to the pile. So, 20 cents a pound is what I paid for this. There'll be no plug soup though. I tried plug soup, I didn't care for it. I don't know if it just didn't have enough seasoning in it or what, but... Yeah, see there's a whole bunch of USBs. And they're already cut! So, no really big deal. These are a dollar ten a pound right now. So, um, if I wanted to, I could check with the other scrapyard and see if they got a nitwit cutting ends off there, and I could buy it off of them too. So, that's my benefit. Yes, yes, there's one right there. All right, five. Um, you know, I have two scrapyards that I can uh, get inventory from, so. Never a, never a reason to have uh, no inventory. Plus my computer guy. I gotta get out of here without killing myself. Oh, Lord. Uh-oh. Hold on. Oh, Jesus. All right, there we go. Yep, so... Whew, my plan is to... Hopefully get these all done today, or damn close to it. Um, they were out to here, so I did all the way back to there, and they're all that high. So I did a lot of them yesterday. So I've got to clean that out, and then I want to take all the board sort of stuff, which is these totes here, and then all this here back. Um, put that outside, so I have some room in here to... Uh, Put some other crap in there. Somebody in my comments said you're not going to take the aluminum out of there. And I said, I am not. 
that should have actually went in the uh, shred bucket or the shred load because I cut the cord off. So these and these go together. Board sort. I'm not gonna sit here and pound transformers that are that big out of them. Not me. You guys can do it. I ain't that desperate yet. Not that desperate yet. And I have all these here. Gotta do. Um, I gotta send these and a bunch of other crap to my refiner. Um, his prices are like really, really, really high right now. So I'm gonna get him a box out this weekend. I'm gonna do my I series for sure and send that box out as well. So Chris has something to do down there. So just sitting around doing nothing. He must be busy because I haven't heard too much from him. Or he's just tired of my shit. One of the two. I'd go with the second one. So, so it's going to be a beautiful, beautiful day. And I'm just going to keep cranking these out. Keep cranking them out. So, I got to add my CD ROMs. Those are $5 a pound. These are all clean, ready to go. Just have to sort them out. A uh, little bit more memory there I gotta add to the pile. <clears throat> Plus what I just picked up today. These I'll just wait for the next load. These are uh, IDE, the, the high grade uh, hard drives. Um, I'm thinking about maybe cutting a wire off of these and taking these down there with me. They're 20 cents a pound or 13 or 14 cents a pound. Uh, the wire I can just throw in a bucket for now because I gotta cut all the ends off of that anyway. And then I can fill up that box over there. But my 45% wire. It's so weird to look in the boxes over there and there's no ends on any of them. I mean, it's just like nice clean wire. <laughs> kind of neat. Not for me, though. Uh, I'm thinking about taking these. This is like $100 right here. These were the nine pounders yesterday, but I appreciate you guys letting me know how much that weighed because I really didn't remember that quick. But um, I'll probably add to that. These I don't, you know, not that much there. These I'll pile up. Slot processors, IC chips. Um, we'll pile those up yet for a little bit, and see what we get. Most of these are pinless, so you don't get too much out of them. And I'm going to have a ton of uh, the uh, heat sinks, which are all MLC and refinery ends. I'm gonna have a boatload of them. I got a tote there. I got this overflow tote here. They're laying all over the crap. Plus all these other computers have them. And I got a bad feeling that the other scrapyard is gonna call me next week to come and get some more computers. So it is what it is. So but that's it guys. That is it. We got a clean computer wire. All this wire in here has to be cleaned yet. So I'm going to have barrels of wire. Barrels upon barrels upon barrels. That's an empty barrels. So we can put some wire in there. Look, I put holes in the bottom and the water's still in there. Why did I bother? This is all breakage, but there's a bunch of power supplies in here. So i got to dig those out. If I take them to Ohio, which I'm going to have a lot of room in the van, so I probably will. Had a little rain last night, so the lake is filled back up. The doggy's still back there, hanging out. So, that's it guys. I'm going to get to work and uh, see what I can get accomplished today and tomorrow. And um, I have to uh, order the U-Haul uh, for Monday morning. Usually I get it like the day before and load it. So, I might just uh, have to go pick it up Sunday. And I usually I pick it up Sunday and I rent it for two days and then um, technically I don't have to have it back till like Tuesday, but I usually take it back the day we uh, come back, and it saves me uh, quite a bit of money. But I would do two days because I don't want to get up in the early in the morning to load up this crap and then hit the road. So I like to have it loaded up and just get in the van and go. Get in the van and go. So. With that, I'm going to get to work here. So, appreciate y'all. Stay safe. Keep doing what you're doing. I will catch you all later.